do-it-yourself project. And you'll definitely want to check out the EY Center this weekend. The Ottawa Home and Remodeling Show is taking over the capital, featuring landscaping companies, remodeling contractors, interior design companies, and so much more. Someone who will be at the show is Katrina Barclay, who owns Malenka Originals. Good morning. Good morning. Let's just first talk about what you guys do at Malenka Originals. Well, uh, we have a shop. We've moved now to Hintonburg, okay. and it's a shop and workshop. So we run a lot of classes helping people to upcycle their furniture, refresh their furniture, mm -hmm. give it a new life. We uh, use Annie Sloan chalk paint a lot, but we also use a lot of other products for finishing. Okay. So yeah, so we like to teach people how to do it themselves. Some I know people are going to say, like, I'm not crafty, I'm not good at this. <laughs> do you need to have any sort of remodeling or redecorating kind of skills behind you? No, and this is one of the messages I'm going to even talk about in one of my presentations presentations at the Ottawa Home and Remodeling Show is that anybody can do this. This is for people who may have not even picked up a paintbrush before or have wow. never done anything crafty in their lives. This is something that anybody can do. Okay, we're looking at some of the furniture that you've remodeled. Absolutely stunning. What goes behind the idea? Because if you have someone who says they're not very visual or not very good at coordinating colors, can you help out with that? Oh yeah, for sure. And we have really, uh, our staff is amazing at that as well. So if you come in with an idea or just a project you want to do, show us pictures. Of course, we'll help you with all the colors and the techniques and things like that. Okay, so you have a chair for us here this morning. You've started painting it. Yeah, so one of the things that we're doing at the show is we're working with Habitat for Humanity Restore. They've okay. donated some furniture, including this old chair. And so I'm gonna show people how to redo a chair like this. It was quite boring. We put on this applique there. So you put that on so, the floor, Yeah, so that's it. gonna be painted and then we'll do some fun uh, techniques over top of it. But you can also paint fabric. Really? And so, yeah, and that's one, of the, uh, that's one of the things people come in all the time really excited about. So you can paint directly onto fabric. You just need a little bit of water to really help it soak in. Okay. And you can really quite quickly and easily that's have a completely new look. Amazing, okay, this is a different chair, but I just wanna show what you've yeah, done Yeah, so here. this was a another um, Habitat for Humanity Restore chair. It was just a, quite a boring kind of green chair before. But what we did is we painted it in that underneath color that's uh, okay, so called there's French the linen. Before. It looks completely different. Right, yeah, just a wow. run-of-the-mill chair that you know people probably don't even really want anymore. No. So, so we painted it and then I did a stencil on top using this deer head stencil. So you um, painted that green fabric? Yeah, well, yes, yeah, just straight on top of it. Wow, that's yeah, incredible. Yeah. I never would have realized to paint the fabric. Exactly, and then we did some, had some fun on the legs, did some gilding and um, some foils. And we're gonna have all that stuff out at our booth at the Home and Remodeling Show. We're okay. going to have, people can come and try to stencil, can try to gild foils, all of that they can sort of come in and play around with. So what's this foiling all about? Because I've yeah. been hearing about this, but I'm not quite sure how it works. So, um, yeah, it's really easy to use. So what we've done is we've just applied this um, this medium on here. So it's a little okay. bit sticky I, I right now. I did notice it is a little yeah, sticky. Yeah, but it, take this gold foil. I think that would look really nice. And just okay. put it down. Maybe try on that rose area there. Okay. Put it like shiny that. side up. Yeah, we'll just put shiny side up. Oh, yeah, shiny that side way. up. Part of me. Yeah. Just, you can even just put it like that. Okay. And then just rub it. Just rub it a little bit. Rub the flowers. Yeah, yeah. Rub, rub all around. We can, yeah, because I put the, the gold sides on a few areas. So just rub around, give it a little bit of pressure. And then once we pull it up, we should see a little bit of bling on there, hopefully. Okay, am I doing it properly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah give that a try. You can probably even pull it up now. It's, it's, it's really quite easy <gasps> to use. Yeah, look what you did. Wow, that is stunning. I'm gonna show the nice close-up of that. That is beautiful. So is this something you do on molding, or where would you do this? You can do this on anything, like even this little design here. That would be a great place to do that. Or you can do it on corners <gasps> or edges. So it's wow. very simple. Yeah, so there's an example of the same gold foil there that um, Just a lot more of the used. gold rubbed out on the, the paint. Is exactly. that Exactly, yeah. So you go through a few more times. You go over it a few more times. And you have different colors too, like the silver. Yes, yeah. There's, um, there's turquoise ones, and we have... Uh, copper and wow, we have so many tin different things. and red and black and so yeah you can really um really make your furniture special and the nice thing about your workshop is you have them in so many different different i guess styles as well that you do everything from furniture to your kitchen cabinets oh of course yeah you can paint um just about anything you can paint it on metal on melamine on wood on plastic 
fabric, and you don't have to have an artsy background. So where can don't. people find you at the EY Center? So yeah, we're going to have a booth. It's called Try DIY. You can come and find us there. We also have presentations on Friday night and Saturday nights. Okay, thank you so much for joining us today, Katrina. And of course, we want to send you there. We have a pair of tickets, a four pack of tickets to give away. If you want to go to the Ottawa Home and Remodeling Show this weekend at the EY Center, all you have to do is email us right now. Pick me at CTV for your chance to win a four pack of tickets. Again, pick me at CTV ca for your chance to win a pair of tickets. I know my mom's a huge fan of the chalk paint. Oh, good. She uses it for everything. Oh, it's that's great. great. It's so nice and it's so easy to use. It isn't is it? very easy yeah. to use. Thank you so much and best of luck at the show me. this week.